Inkscape just released version 4.1, and it's a game changer. From Chaos Cosmos asset delivery to smarter lighting, realistic grass, and major performance upgrades, you'll want to see what's inside. Let's dive into everything new in Inkscape 4.1. Hi, this is Farman from CAD Show, where I bring you the latest SketchUp, Inkscape, and rendering tutorials. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe so you never miss important updates like this one. The biggest change in 4.1 is Chaos Cosmos asset delivery. The assets are the same, but the system behind them is completely upgraded. Better search and filtering. A modern interface for browsing and placing assets. And the option to download all assets at once. This makes asset management faster, cleaner, and ready for future updates. In fact, all the new assets coming soon will only be available through Cosmos, so upgrading is a must. Inkscape also added colored sun shadows for software ray tracing in ultra quality. This means more realistic sunlight, atmospheric fog, and richer captures and walkthroughs. Next, some exciting workflow upgrades. Revit graphics overrides are now included when exporting to V-Ray. And for Rhino users, PBR roughness textures are fully supported in Inkscape, while keeping compatibility with older materials. This gives you more accurate materials across platforms. Nature also got a Mac over grass materials now look more natural with better slope placement, smoother height variation, and realistic density. And yes, more improvements are on the way. One of my favorite updates is automatic level of detail. Inkscape now simplifies geometry in the background depending on your view. The result? Faster rendering and smoother navigation, even in heavy scenes. For organizations, administrators can now disable AI features like Veras and AI Enhancer through a simple system variable. That means more control and flexibility for large teams. So that's everything new in Inkscape 4.10 Chaos Cosmos assets, smarter lighting, better materials, improved grass, faster performance, and more stability. Which update are you most excited about Cosmos? LOD? or the new lighting? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button, share it with your design community, and subscribe to CAD Show for more SketchUp and Inkscape tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.